welcome to today's video and today it's time I've been saying that I'm going to do this job for weeks and I keep putting it off and keep putting it off but today's the day today's the day I'm going to sort through my makeup through my dressing table through my chest of drawers because oh, I don't even remember what I've got in there now it's time to have a proper declutter get rid of all the old makeup makeup that I'm never going to use again like colors that I would I've got but I won't use um go through all of the other bits and bobs that I've got in those drawers like I say this is going to be a minefield because I, I don't even remember what I've got in there um so come and join me as I declutter all of our beauty stuff okay so before we begin let me just show you the state of affairs that is my dressing table right now it's very it's a very sad state of affairs that's what it is um okay so over here i've got three makeup bags on the go Pfft. so i've got this is like my main makeup bag that i use for a lot of stuff like my day-to-day -day stuff but then I've kind of transferred things into other makeup bags. So for some reason I've got my makeup in there, like my day-to-day -day makeup. And then I've started putting my brushes that I use day-to-day, -day, or like my blenders and things and my eyelash curlers in here. I don't know why. Uh, this is my handbag makeup bag, which has not been in a handbag for the longest time. I can't remember the last time I wore a handbag. Um, so yeah, so that's my handbag makeup bag. Um, I've got some baby wipes to wipe things down with. Um, in here is just like a pot. I got this like in the sale, in the January sale, and it had some makeup in. And I've just sort of been stashing hair bubbles in there, random lip glosses. Here is like my day-to-day -day skin stuff. Um, oh, well, Jo Malone perfume as well. Um, the, God, there's just, it's just a bit of a mess. Hair stuff over here, like excess brushes. The, I don't even use these brushes, so these can just go. I've got more skincare stuff down there. Over here, I've got my ring light. I've got my brushes uh, and combs and things here. Um, a Kindle, you know, for watching Disney Plus in the morning. And then, well, oh God, I'm even, I'm, I'm embarrassed. Oh, I've got my label maker. We'll talk about that in a second. Um, but that's ready. I've started creating labels. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of embarrassed to show you the drawers. But you know what? We're going to do it. We're just going to go for it. So, this is drawer number one. Oh, there's the lid. I was looking for that lid because I want to put that somewhere else. Anyway, um, here is just a mess we've got some random palettes some foundations and this one well well it's just a bit of a jumble um lipsticks uh god <laughs> bits of bits of lip liner shavings oh my god this is embarrassing um a national trust carb sticker yeah because that belongs in there listen this is just a sorry state of affairs so i think what i'm gonna do first of all I'm just going to clear everything, just get everything off, everything out, and um, yeah, let's begin. So before I begin, um, I just wanted to show you these tubs. These are food tubs that I got from Aldi. You get a pack of three for one ninety nine, and this is what I plan to use. I've already started, kind of made a start. I just wanted to see if it fit, and it did. Um, I plan to label these up and put things in them um, for some kind of organisation and I, th I thought these would be a good way of these food tubs just sit really nicely in the drawers so I'm going to get these out and then take everything out and start putting things into the tubs so then I can I have like a starting point also you may think this is weird but I've just opened up a bin bag on the floor because makeup is messy and I have a cream carpet so I'm going to put all of the makeup onto the bin bag dressing table is all clean drawers are all clean and ready for things to go back inside and i have been sorting out 
my makeup into the tubs. Also, I got these smaller tubs. These were a pack of five. And I thought these would be good to divide up my lipsticks. So basically what I've done is I've gone through all of my makeup, things that I don't use anymore, I've binned, I've discarded, and then this is what I'm keeping. So I've got tubs for blushes and like highlighters and things. This is primers and setting powders and things. Uh, and then I've divvied lipsticks up into colours. So these are like pinks and purples. These are autumn colours, like browns and things. These are nudes and then these are reds. This tub here is lip liners and lip glosses and you know the duo ones that I like from Primark. So they're in there. And then this one here is all eye bits, so eyeliners, um, mascaras, a couple of like single eyeshadows in there. And then these bits here, I've got um, palettes and things, but I need to sort through the palettes because I've got a whole drawer over there dedicated to palettes. So I think I'm going to swap out ones that I'm using and put them in like my main drawers here uh, and then put away ones that I'm not using. I've got my foundations, my powders that I use on a daily basis um, and this I use on a daily basis as well. This is my um, eyebrow palette. I've got a couple of skin bits from Charlotte Tilbury. I found a random banana foldable shopping bag. <laughs> I mean it's random, I'll keep it. Um, anyway, right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and label these little tubs now. I already made a start, well, I was testing out the label maker and I made these little labels, but I think I'm going to change them a bit now and put exactly what are in there. Um, but yeah, right, let's get on and label. This label machine was, I think this was like £14 from Amazon. It's a little dynamo label machine. It's really easy to use, you just click click the letters you want and then it embosses it onto these little labels here and you can get all different colour um, backgrounds as well so you can get neon ones, white ones, all that kind of stuff. Um, anyway, right, I'm going to get on and label my tubs. <music> dressing table is done one thing down another six drawers to go but anyway this is what I've done to the dressing table so it's now completely decluttered on the top I haven't got any brushes on display I've put the brushes inside the other makeup bag which is inside this makeup bag so this is my everyday bits and bobs so my powders that I use every day my bronzers my foundations all the brushes everything is in there um, and then the brushes are inside the makeup bags in there so I know where everything is this little tub here I mean this is just a stopgap for now because I want to get an organizer for my creams and serums and things that I use every single day oh another foundation there because I use that as well a lot but I've left that one out um yeah so my creams and stuff I didn't want to put them in the drawers so I've put them in this little tub for now but I will get some kind of organizer thing uh then I've switched out the spotty um tin that had my brushes and combs in for this little pink one here the spotty one is over here but i'm going to utilize it somewhere else which will become apparent another day uh, anyway my drawers do you want to look at the drawers because oh my god i'm so impressed with my drawers so lipsticks are in the little pots now so we've got the browns the reds the pinks the nudes lip glosses and lip liners I've got eye bits in this tub primers in this tub blushes and then the highlighters wouldn't fit in there because these were overflowing so i've got highlighters and um primers and fixers and setting sprays and stuff and then a couple of charlotte tilbury creams in there so they're the drawers that's the dressing table I'm very impressed. Right, on to these. <sighs>
Okay, so these drawers were the ones that I was dreading, actually. Um, now, in the top... Oh, this. Actually, I got sent this as a PR gift the other day. I thought I'd mention it. It's a overnight hyaluron hyaluronic <laughs> tan balm for the face. I'm yet to try it, but I've just left that on the top. Um, anyway, um, in the top, you probably already know, but are all of my earrings. I'm not going to touch them today because I sorted them out the other day. This top drawer here... Oh, my God... <laughs> <laughs> ah we've got dodgy like primark earrings that i've used two pairs and not used the rest some necklaces sunglasses um oh a wire i don't know what that's for we'll sort that in a minute my god this one here is my camera drawer this one is quite neat and tidy because i keep this one tidy because i know what's in here so i've got my spare Canon G7X, the first one. Another random pair of sunglasses, they can come out. Uh, my notebook for notes and things. Um, these, I tried these wing jammers for my camera. They're like little fluffy things, but it didn't work. But anyway, a couple of little mini tripods, um, a little adapter thing, and my cases. So there, that's my camera drawer. This drawer here is my palettes drawer, which is, a I've thrown the ones that were um in the drawers just back in here for now so i've got my palettes in here <laughs> more sunglasses <laughs> some brushes um oh we've got oh we've got some hand washes hand sanitizers bye felicia they'll come in handy right now um so that's that drawer this drawer is my hair drawer so i've got hair grips um hair sprays what else have i got in here detangling spray uh dry shampoo so that's my hair drawer. I used to have my hair dryer and straighteners in there, but now they live in this little tub here. Um, this one here is like my pamper drawer. So like face masks and all that kind of stuff um, in here. So I do need more sunglasses. Oh my God, I have a problem. And then this one here is just random. Got a couple of hair bits and oh, right. Let's start at the top and work my way down, shall I? I am done but firstly look what I found I bought this from ASOS about two years ago and I've never worn it I've never had a reason to wear it this was supposed to be like a going out necklace I was going to wear like a black bardo top and then this is going to be my statement piece but I just I haven't gone out and we're, we're not going out at the moment are we but I thought I'd put it on it's really heavy but it's so pretty it's so pretty I'm going to keep this on for a minute anyway Drawers are all done, I will show you them in a second. Um, but firstly, I'll show you the things that I'm getting rid of. So the palettes that I'm getting rid of are this Body Shop palette. It's not very good, it's not, the pigment is rubbish, so that's going. Um, I'm getting rid of my Naked On The Run palette. Inside it had um, five different eyeshadows, a blusher, highlighter, and um, bronzer. And then you had a lip gloss, uh, an eyeliner that was there, I don't know where that is now, and an eye sh um, a mascara. Didn't really, I liked the palette at the time, but I have no reason to keep it, so that's going. Um, I like the box though, I like the packaging. This was always handy for travel, because it's got like the big mirror and everything. Um, and then this Urban Decay Vice palette, which is great in theory, but all the lipstick's starting to bobble. So that's, ooh, that's not good, is it? So, um, I think we'll bin that. Okay, I'm going to take this necklace off now because it's really heavy. How am I going to wear this on a night out? I'll be like, oh. Oh. Right, time to show you the drawers. Um, I'm very impressed with actually my organisational skills with the drawers. They look very neat and tidy now. I've got a pile of stuff here that has got to go into the bathroom because I've got like micellar water so like skincare stuff i'm moving into the bathroom because that's where i'm going to use it you know when i'm getting ready for bed and stuff so all the skincare stuff all the perfumes that i found and sprays and things they're all going um 
into the bathroom. Okay, now on to the drawer. So I showed you the top one earlier. That's got all of my earrings in and things. This one here now, oh my goodness, I found so many sunglasses. Now I've already got a sunglasses case in the wardrobe. Um, and then this is like overflow stuff. So I've put all of them in here. So this is like my sunglasses drawer now. This is no different really. This is my technology drawer. I've just put a couple of pairs of scissors in there. Um, this one here was my palette drawer. So I've sorted them all out now. Got rid of the ones that I wanted to get rid of and I've kept these ones. So I've got my big bulky ones, the tiny little ones, like travel ones. So I've got um, three Makeup Revolution eyeshadow palettes in there. I really still rate this one, the Fortune Favours, the Brave palette and the Sof palette and then one of the chocolate palettes. I've got an Inglot palette in here, which I really like the colours in there. Then I've got all of my Urban Decay palettes. So I've got Naked 2, Naked 3, Heat palette, the Smoky palette, that's what I've got in New York and then the Cherry palette. So they're my Urban Decay palettes. I've got my... Um, stars what's it called stars in your eyes palette from charlotte tilbury and then i've got all my little travel ones so i've got my little mac ones the, the ones like the nine sets so i've got my little pastels one then my wintery one i've got an old one there i just can't bear to part with this one this is like one of my first mac palettes i've got a burberry one uh, a charlotte tilbury one a bobby brown one look at this one look at that look how pretty this one is so I'm keeping this one because it's pretty. Also, I like the product that's in there. It's got um, highlighters. Look at those. So, so pretty. Um, I've got a blusher palette there, Revolution blusher palette. And then this is my, I got this out of a beauty box. And actually, I quite like it. This is the um, Pixie Hello LA Angel um, eyeshadow palette. And it's got a couple of bronzers in there and a blusher. Uh, and then I've got, I've still got this like little gift set that I got from Sephora that I've not used yet but I do love the Kat Von D eyeliner so I've kept that there um so that's my palette drawer here is now my hair care drawer so I've got hair sprays um heat protectant sprays detangling sprays um dry shampoo all that kind of stuff is there I've got these rollers that I haven't used yet from Primark I might use them um seeing as we've got nothing else to do um the heatless ones yeah the heatless ones and then I've got um some hair treatment argonal hair treatment bits in there a coconut milk mask and then these I've utilized a couple of the tubs so I'm going to put like scrunchies and things in that one then here I've put all of my bobby pins and hair bubbles I didn't realize I had so many you know when you lose bobby pins and you wonder where they all go well now I found them all also I had a lot on a like a sheet that I bought <laughs> so I've just took them off and put them in there now so they're all together this drawer is my well it's like my little pamper drawer and travel drawer so I've got all pampery bits here so like face masks nail stuff stick on nails false eyelashes that kind of thing and then in this this is an old glossy box box but i really like the box i've kept all my little travel um bits and bobs travel toiletries in there so we've got like shampoos hairsprays that kind of thing so i'll keep those all together i've also got um a makeup bag that my mum got me for christmas a couple of years ago and i do like this so i might use this at christmas time so i keep that because i really like that oh and i've got my very first kate spade makeup bag i mean the little taggy bits fell off now but i can't get rid of that i can't okay and last but not least is the bottom drawer which has got all of my hair utensils well kind of the overflow so this tub here has got my everyday hair dryer and straighteners and then this is like my curlers my extra straighteners my little wave things like bits that i bought that i haven't i haven't really used yet um so that's like all hair utensils in there and um yeah that's it and that is it we're finished it's only took me two hours to do all that but i kind of feel like two hours well spent 
I feel it's been a very productive couple of hours and I feel like I have some kind of order in here now. I'm totally in love with the drawers. They all feel nice and lovely now. You saw what disarray they were in before. I've got a huge bin bag of stuff here. Um, of stuff that I just, I haven't needed. Um, so yeah, it's been good to have a little bit of a declutter, a little bit, a lot of a declutter. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys for the next one. Bye.